the new Shakti Fab will produce specialized military chips for night vision, secure ra radios, missile seekers, and AI powered centers of fusion, making India the first to build the multi chip military fab outside the US. Big Indian groups like the Tata are building new semiconductor plants, often working with trusted international partners from Taiwan, the US, and Japan. India currently imports most of its high end military chips. And this dependence is a big strategic risk if supply lines are disrupted or rival nations embed security threats. 5G networks, if built with untrusted foreign suppliers, would become conduits for surveillance or sabotage, making network security and indigenous development a priority. The good news is that the policy reforms, new investment, and decisive move towards homegrown tech are bridging these gaps with key military and space launches relying on Indian chips and networks every year. Making our own chips and networks isn't just about technology, it's about sovereignty. Digital independence gives India the power to act, react and adapt in a world where wars start with the ether and get settled in the real world. Patalya's Arthashastra warns, know the enemy's thought is to rule the outcome. In war, that can mean life or death. India's armed forces already use secure, indigenous 5G systems in critical missions and no foreign 5G hardware is being imported to avoid hidden risk from adversaries. India launches the new semiconductor mission to develop local chip for design and manufacturing, aiming for self-reliance and less dependence on China, the US and Europe.